Here's a little detail that is often overlooked, but can make such a big difference when it comes to how professional your funnel looks. And it is adding a favicon to your sales funnel. And the favicon is this little thing we see in the browser tab. And by default, it is the ClickFunnels favicon. But you want to make sure that you add your own logo or your own little favicon to your funnel. And it is actually really simple to do that. All you have to do is go to your settings, and then you want to go here to digital assets. Click on add new asset. Choose a file from your computer and it should be a square file and it should be 500 times 500 pixel. Then you want to name the asset favicon. You could also add your email address and a message, but for the favicon it is not necessary. So just click add. Now we see that this asset was successfully added and all we have to do now is go here and say copy asset path. Do that and then go back to your funnel. Now you want to go to the funnel settings and here you can see the favicon URL. All you have to do now is paste the URL that you just copied. Scroll all the way down and say save and update settings. This is it. Don't worry if it doesn't change immediately. It can take ClickFunnels up to two days to actually refresh it. So also keep in mind that this is something you probably want to do a bit earlier on in the design and configuration process and not in the last minute before you want to launch your funnel. Okay, that's it for this video. See you in the next one.